this is an area that very few postmen have to come out and guard. This is also an area out front, when we get to our two positions here, that very few forwards are post guard. And certainly when we cut through to the basket, that is an area that very few guards have to guard. So what we want to try to take advantage of, not just mismatches, but mismatches within a ge geographical area of the court. Now, we start the particular drill here with the ball, and we would like our, as far as spacing goes, we're going to put two lines foul line extended, and we're going to have two guards no further than two steps above the three-point line. We would like to keep them in this area here, very close to the keyhole. We're going to start the drill on the opposite side, and as we, ex as we bring one person, a cutter, the coach is going to make him make a decision at the last minute. If he plays him below the foul line, this young man is going to cut up and assume the guard position. He's going to try to make a 90 degree cut on this, a plant, a turn, and he's going to try to catch it on his uphill hand in a jump stop and pivot and watch the cutter through. When the pass is made, the cutter makes a diagonal cut to the block. If he does not get it, then he go ahead and he precedes out and he fills the line. Soon as he hits the foul line, our next cutter comes. The coach makes a decision, that time stops, please. He stepped above, which simulated a denial, and we back cut to the basket. I have the option of letting him go through, which he would come out the same side, or throwing in the pass for the lay-in. And we will make the lay-in, and if we do, he'll throw it back to me, the next cutter comes. 